been fun spending some time on the campus of uh, Caldwell University. I want you to meet Lamar Shea Chang, very smart young man from Jamaica, just completed a double major in pre-med and computer information technology. So I had two questions for him. How different is New Jersey from Jamaica, and how different was it for him to graduate this year? Oh, definitely way less beaches, that for one. Um, <laughs> but as it relates to the lifestyle, being able to just go out on the street and be able to get everything I need, yes, it's really lovely around here. Everything's close by. It's definitely not what I pictured four years ago. It is a crazy time with everything changing. A lot of gears I had to personally shift to ensure that I stayed on top given the radical changes in the market. I would say take it easy on yourself. We all had a lot of dreams. We all had a different aspirations. The changing times doesn't mean we have to change our personal goals and ambitions. All we'd have to do is just find out how we could best adapt to facilitate those dreams and personal goals from happening. Piece by piece, Michael wins. That's how I personally do it. A little win at a time gets me where I want to go. I love that micro wins a little win at a time and cindy you'll appreciate this the other thing lamar did uh when everybody was locked down he would go out on campus and he would encourage people to exercise from a distance he got everybody going because he knows how important that is as well so impressed with these uh, graduates this year everything they're going through they're still meeting these challenges and getting ready to uh, face their future Back to you. Lamar is so bubbly and positive. Did you talk to him at all about what he wants to do in the future? Oh, my goodness. He wants to <laughs> what practice does he want to do? medicine. He, he, what, what, what did he want to yeah, do? He wants to practice medicine. Okay. He wants to practice medicine here, and then he's very committed to mission outreach work, so he wants to do that back in Jamaica, and all the while keeping his eye on business as well. Very impressive wow. young guy. I really appreciate you bringing us all these stories because it gives us hope to have such wonderful young people. Thank you, John.